Greetings to my team of 144, all star seeds, love workers, and way shores. It is 11112019111. Happy 1111 Gateway Portal. How are you all feeling today? I'm sure most of you listening to this transmission are feeling these massive waves coming in, these cosmic waves through this portal opening. Earth was rocking and rolling today, over 120 earthquakes in the past 24 hours. Biggest one was in Indonesia, 5.0, and the whole Ring of Fire was active. There were earthquakes all along the Ring of Fire, which surrounding in the Pacific Ocean. And I saw today that there is a solar eclipse on December 26, where it creates a Ring of Fire around the Sun which will be the day after Christmas, and then the next one will be on June 21st, 2020, which will be on the summer solstice. So we got this ring of fire on the sun close to the solstice of the winter on the Tropic of Capricorn, and then on June 21st on the Tropic of Cancer, connecting the north with the south. So this is more symbolism of the prophecy, the eagle flying with the condor, the north, the divine masculine fire of the north, the eagle, will fly with the divine feminine of the waters of the sacred condor of the south. Part of this activation for the ascension and the awakening of human consciousness on a collective level. Now check out the video I posted earlier today if you haven't seen it with a transmission, a gathering of my closest soul family. I call the Divine 44 that I've been working with over the last few months to assist all of humanity on this ascension process. And watch to the end, at the end of the video, where we do a powerful healing transmission for all star seeds, light workers stationed around this realm, anchoring in your code, your light, your love, into the grid, wherever you're positioned right now, through this realm, we're all over the world, anchoring our sacred codes, our sacred light, into the grid of Gaia, into the sacred grid, to activate all portals and all gateways for the ascension of all life in all realms. So thank you all that are on mission for this greatest mission ever in eternity. So feel into that. Today's first transmission, the 1111 portal, Aligning with the Highest Love by Jillian Macbeth Louthen. As the 1111 energies enter, let them purge you of what has been solidified and blocked. All of heaven known and unknown enters through this 1111 gateway. Align with all you know to be the highest love. A flooding of the heart allows you to rise above previous emotional tide lines and barnacles of the past. Set sail into a heart that is free of debris, free of the definitions of the past. What is good within you has survived the storms and the floods. What was darkened has been cleared and polished into a bright light. You are being reformatted in thought and deed into a place where you can consciously conceive a world that is better than what you prayed for. Anoint with this knowledge for a new level of life that has been sequestered bursts forth from your atoms. You are surging with galactic memories and truths that have laid dormant deep within your DNA, waiting for the exact energetic signature to awaken them. Burst free from the previous shackles of limitation and fly high on the spiraling winds of truth beyond thinking and time contained. Your eternal heart will lead you in the direction of perfect flow. Yes, you are coming undone. Yes, you are releasing. And yes, you will lose focus of what you thought was truth. Jump from this bridge of limitation and learn to fly by trust and trust alone. There is no one to stop you but you. Your life is your own creation. Choose either to be a victim or a victor. Ask that all has been done against you now blesses you in the fullness of time. Move towards a longitude of light that awaits your presence. Light has a need to serve, to embrace, to become one with. Without you, the light sits alone in the waiting. 1111 is a number activation sequence. Each time that you see 1111 on a clock, it represents that you are being given an opportunity to walk into a gateway of manifestation. The universe has just taken a snapshot of your thoughts, which then are manifesting into the physical in record speed. 
The time period from November 11th to January 11th is considered to be the Holy Trinity months. All in all, it is a divine decree and opportunity issued to all of earth, wake up and become your true light. 11 is also the number of masters. 1111 is an encoded molecular structure of remembrance, activating the master of light we have always been. This is the biological ascension, and 1111 is the ascension doorway. The light of ascension comes in many forms and on many levels. It comes not always in one day or one moment, for we ascend and descend continually, word by word, thought by thought. Ascension is birth from every breath, every thought, and every word. The energies of the 1111 doorway are enhanced by nature and her hidden sounds. All of life views you and knows your secrets. The trees whisper about your sadness. The fairies leave you a feather as a sign and you are loved and watched over. The birds sing to heal you. This 1111 door asks you to listen to what earth speaks to you. Hear with your heart. Use the silent sounds within your own quiet universe. Allow the pulsing of your blood, the beat of your heart, the sound of your breath to be heard as music of the spheres. Even the cracking of your knees and bones gives to you the sound of life and all its frailties and vulnerabilities. Humanely you expand and spiritually you will soar. There is no longer just white or black in the universal playing field. There exists a gray, unbiased area that asks you to enter. The gray says that you sit and rest as yourself decides about right or wrong, dark or light, good or bad. The gray area is impartial, free of comment, free of pressure and stress. Use this gray time to decode the secrets that live within you. You exist multidimensionally. All of your actions of Earth are as a centerpiece. You are an intersection of dimensional fluxes. All of your choices here on Earth also influence the outcomes of other stellar and galactic experiences. All avenues of time and space deliver your messages, incoming and outgoing. Time to listen and learn. You sit at a longitude and latitude that requests the presence of a higher level of your own light. Your soul broadcasts beyond the boundaries that you knowingly seek. The next level of attunement that you seek lives within the solar crossings of your light and thoughts. Your spirit stands ready to take you to uncharted territory. Everything stretches itself looking for more of its true identity. You have been told since time began that ye are gods. This planet that you reside upon is a mecca of prophets. A place where those that are destined for greatness meet to play and act out with one another. As you stand in this portal there will be no more excuses. There will be no more victims. Everything that you do in, uh, in upcoming time influences the outcome events. Every th negative thought that you have about yourself or others shifts the scales of polarity. Every positive thought that you have shifts in accordance with your energy interpretation of events. No longer are you at the mercy of others. All of life and light sits and awaits your actions, your thoughts, and your interpretation. In the minefields of human evolvement, there is a tendency for you to hold on to what keeps you afloat. The 1111 doorways are continually expanding and contracting in accordance with humanity. As one who stands in front of an automatic door, walking back and forth before making up their mind, should they enter or should they exit, you no longer have the luxury of playing with those automatic doors of expansion and contraction for all movement forward is taken as such and agreed upon by the quantum particles. All movement backward is also taken verbatim. It is time to make internal peace. It is necessary before you can ever see the external peace that you so seek. Another cannot birth peace for you. Only self has that ability. It is time for you to enter all that you have held secret and sacred within yourselves. Everything that you seek lives within the cellular memory and DNA composition. Your every word, your every thought, your every intention is received as a child who plays within all of light. Octaves of what is hidden reveals itself as a scroll that is rolled out to be read in the language of the heart, but not understood by the eyes. Everything holds a holy composition within it. We are living light within sound. Within your words, within your voice is living light. You are the language of light that you so seek to speak. The geometries of your words and your intent is felt above all other things. We leave. The source, thequantumawakening.com and from Sarah Sistar, 
The 1111 gateway that has opened is sensing a pivotal surge of energetic wave of light that cannot be attempted to be dismantled, for it is the restorers of peaceful presence that are bringing together the bridge of what can be understood as the physical realm into the higher vibrational all-seeing sensing view. The holy eye of oneness and peace and loving devotion is shaking up the still unaware. For those that are embracing their evolutionary process, the cosmic codes are being brought to the heart in remembrance and opening the conscious awareness. Yet it is most important to once again anchor in the heart as well as through the grounding of our physical bodies within the earth frequencies so as to stabilize this energy for the highest good of all. If you are experiencing a sense of pause or unrest, please know you are not alone and that we are being fully supported across the energetic grid web that has been created to insist with this influx of higher frequencies to uplift humanity in the shifting of perspective. The creation of the crystalline heart is encoded in the divine remembrance of the one soul both as the planet shifts, so shall humans too, and vice versa. The interconnectedness is infused with the timeline shifting and interlacing in the highest source of loving embodiment of the cosmic heart. Hold true, stand in your power center. The grid workers are establishing the support through the frequency codes of light beyond the minuscule knowledge of human explanation, rather through the deepest sense of inner intelligence and the soul's encoding. The emergence of this will stabilize all frequencies in the planet to create harmonic convergence that will be felt across the earth grids as well as through the hearts of the inhabitants of her life force system. The shifting of the ley lines will be activated as the times of a plenty will reveal. Revelation is close at hand for all to discover, uncover, and shift perspective to truly see the magnificence of the divine creation as delivered by our highest frequency embodiment of the divine. You are loved as I am as we are. 1111 portal activating the heart from Laura Pleiadian. This 1111 portal and the accompanied awakening of the higher heart is a transitioning of frequencies from one level to the next. An initiation and a graduation of source. Source is the ability to hold within your cells the higher frequencies. No one can bypass the cellular process, yet all is completed in a moment when ready. This activation takes place through the readiness and willingness to be the conduit of these higher frequencies. Remembering that when one enters into a new world, all that was previous to the new world ends also. This is the death and rebirth. So how many truly are ready then for this and desire this? To be ready for the new level, 1111 portal activation to be received would be through the frequency result of the releasing of attachments to the current reality. Cause of the readiness is the release of attachments. Looking directly at the cause of anything, we view it through the current level of association with matter as a reality functioning frequency portal filter. We do not see beyond now and what it is and how it is our consciousness is functioning or what we may actively do at the lower level to attain the higher. Even though we may not know what is behind the curtain of this life filled with surprises, we may cert be certain of one thing. We are the cause. How we are being is the cause. The frequency level we are being exerts itself as matter frequency and projects itself onto the screen of our reality. So where do we begin? Turn that finger that points out there to the visual stimuli that says this is real to the cause. Check in with yourself and observe yourself till one moment all that you are is the observer that through observing then creates. Now back to the 1111 portal. This portal does not exist in time. This means this may be accessed in any moment. Like a big, huge written text, when you, as an example, know all of the answers, you are ready. When you, you do not know the answers, you are not ready. So then knowing the answers or not knowing the answers is clearly not dependent on time. It is an awareness, a knowing, and a readiness. What it takes to get there is not always a given, as the playing out of memory plays a huge role as far as how much baggage of fear still lays under the coffin of suppressed memory. This coffin of memory hopes to put to rest that which needs to be opened so that the life may breathe, the bats may fly, the reawakening and rebirth may begin. One may wonder what happened to all the memory of our existences, and we say clear out the coffin first of the fear-based memories of beliefs of lack, pain, and separation. 
then as certain as the sun does rise, you will surf the ocean of your existences and be connected consciously to all memory forever. In this now we transmit it to you beyond the words or pictures painted in your head. We have activated your heart as part of your 1111 portal experience that based on your level now leads you to that new life dreamt of held in the memory of all that does truly exist now. Feel through your heart the frequencies beyond imagination so that the soaring may be the freedom and your heart may be the magic carpet you ride. From And this was from Laura Pleiadian from the new divinehumanity.com and today from Christina Papa Giorgio white overtone wind kin 122 11 november 2019 1111 portal 1111 2019 1113 equals 7 11 portal duality doorway partnership 2 times 11 equal 22, architect of peace, master builder. 7, mystical, spiritual, magical. Kin 122 equal 5, change, transformation, and freedom. Today's magical 1111 portal is another divinely orchestrated blessing from spirit, as well as this phenomenal code being brought through the power of spirit with the waves of unconditional love. We also have a rare Mercury transit eclipse happening, which only occurs once every three years. 13 years, Mercury is the winged messenger who represents communication, which is the theme of today. Spirit is talking, giving us the divine message, and Mercury is ensuring we hear it and embody it. Mercury is currently in retrograde until November 20th, so his powers are even more potent in affecting our inner being, our self-talk, and our subconscious messages and program. As Mercury journeys across the path of our radiant sun, he will be embodying these solar codes and reflecting them into our communications and transactions with others, helping us to reset our minds, words, and those of our financial, technological, and communication systems in every arena. The overtone spiritual tone of creation will command that we become more empowered and radiant beings, guided by the power of spirit and the truth of our pure hearts. In God, Goddess, we trust. Day 5 in the white mirror wave spell of reflection, truth, illusion, endlessness, and magnification. A powerfully spiritual day of tuning in and receiving the radiance and empowerment of spirit, which is magnified through white mirror. The white mirror is also magnifying Mercury's shadow as it eclipses the sun, so all shadows will be revealed today. The shadow government and the shadow players will be exposed. This crazy matrix chest game is about to topple. Tone of creation, overtone, tone five in the spiritual realm, action, commands, power, and powers, essence, radiance. Number five represents the center, core purpose, foundation, and central intent. It is the center of the wheel from which all the spokes emanate. This is the phase where the energy of creation returns to the center and then radiates outwards. Overtones command the unbounded. They order it to be and so it becomes. Their power radiates from their soul essence through a pure connection to source. This is the true source of unlimited power. Overtone plus white wind plus white dog is a triple dose of source spirit codes today, magnified, revealed, empowered, and radiated. Awakening of cosmic consciousness in the whole matrix of Gaia, releasing chains imposed by the power to submit to the human race. The power is inside our mind, activating our connection with the creative source, with the strength of our heart, through the love, the best weapon of war that can exist, annihilating its power to collapse, completely breaking old chains, liberating from slavery, all the men and women of the world awakening to the only supreme religion of love where there is no subjugation, manipulations, or division. We are all one. Shalom, Om Om, Om Namaskar, Magdalena Alejandra Moyana. So blessed are we, precious hearts, a powerful day for basking in pure devotion to spirit as you radiate the power of unconditional love through your being. Open the gate and walk through the doorway to your heart, leading you back home to source. Today's question is, how can I empower myself and others through communicating and radiating the power of divine spirit through my pure heart? Divine gratitude for the divine miracle and blessings we are about to receive. Amen. Dream Spell Journey by Valom Votan and Balonik, Kin 122, 
commanding the power of spirit. Mercury transit on 11-11-19. Today's code, today's date is coded 11-11, month 11, day 11, and it is synchronizing with the 2019 Mercury transit. During this rare astronomical event, the planet Mercury is crossing the sun on 11 of November. Today's 11-11-19 Mercury transit is synchronizing with the dream spell Kin 1-2-2, Overtone wind, five wind. The kin represents the overtone tower of the mirror wave spell, and it establishes the spirit wind of the mystic central column of the Zolkin. Kin 122 was the rotation of Lloyd, Lloydine Bolon-Ick in 1991, the year of the dream spell publication, co-authored by her along with Jose R. Willis. Kin 122 also marked the day of meditation 22, which was part of the 28 meditations dictated by Valon Votan and Valon Ick at the Earth Wizards Seminary 1999. 11 Kib, 11 Owl, is the Maya real-time equivalent to 11 Warrior, Kin 76, and the Dream Spell Count. Exactly number 11 of Owl, Warrior, syncs with today's 1111. 11. Therefore, today's kin, unified time, Dream Time Kin 122, plus real time kin, what seven six one two two plus seven six kin one nine three three mirror three etz knob precisely three mirrors the dream spell kin of the ascension of Lloydine Balone Ick. She tr ascended exactly two cartoons twenty years after the discovery of the Maya Queen Zakbua Jaw of Lakama Palenque Temple thirteen sixteen may nineteen ninety four Discovery of Zach Bu, 16 May 2014, Ascension of Balonic. From the Zolkin Matrix perspective, today's 11.11.19 synchronicity refers to the 11.11 code of Valon Votan's Kin 11, 11.11, and Balon X Kin 22, 11 plus 11, within the Dream Spell 1320 count. From the hyperdimensional matrix system's perspective, the 11.11.19 also refers to the sacred wisdom brought forth by the 1919 Crystal Matrix, 19 Matrix. Exactly, this system functions with an inner 1111 inner matrix within the 1919 outer matrix. Therefore, the 19 Matrix exactly contains today's 111119. In this way, today is a divine opportunity to reawaken our crystal archetype guided by the white wind of the crystal prophecy. Hidden within the sacred inner matrix of 1111 is a sixth dimensional portal, a portal which unveils the mythic Merkaba of the higher self. This 2019 Mercury transit opens a nine day portal from 11 November, coded 111119, until 19 November, coded 111919 or 191119, a portal which is fully synchronized with the mystical central column of the Zolkin. This 9-day, 11-11-19-19 portal inscribes day 0 on yesterday's Kin 121, the 11 times 11 self-existing dragon, Kin bearer of the mystic central column, day 1 on today's Kin 122, overtone wind, the spirit tower of the mystic column, day 9, closing 19-11-19 on Kin 130, right at the heart of the Zolkin and its harmonic 33. So many synchronicities here. So the next nine days are going to be powerful activation portal code 11 November 2019 NS1.32.4.25. Kin 122, the white overtone wind. The code for today, the mantra is I am power in order to communicate. Commanding breath, I seal the input of spirit with the overtone tone of radiance. I am guided by the power of heart. Thank you for joining me today, beloved beings of light. Let us know in the comments below this video what you're experiencing, what you're seeing, what you're feeling, your visions through this 1111 portal opening, activation gateway. So have a beautiful and blessed nine day portal activation sequence. I love you all. Namaste.